Hi everyone, welcome back to Simpit Academy. We look at one more set of optional parts, this time for the front console. All of these are non-functional. Um, they are just there to look good and complete. There is no link to DCS BIOS, no wiring required. All right, so this will be a short video. So as you can see, we have four things to add. The glass shield, actually all the way down here, cross. And then all these, um, I don't know even, I don't even know the name. I just call them MPD handles for the MP3, the MPD, three of them. Then we have this uh, DTM module here, like the some kind of like cassette thing simulation with a button that actually doesn't really even move and there's no slot here just a blank piece then we have the breakers here and the air vent which is covered by um, the the stick here All right, so this one I started off with just some, um, you know, leftover Amazon box and I cut it out wherever there is some um, slot or whatever. I just cover it into this shape on two sides. Then when I am happy with the shape, I just use this um, foot black foam board you can get from Walmart or Michaels just a few bucks alright so this one is easy oh, this also depends on the size of your your cockpit right so because I'm using the Thrustmaster Cougar the MPD is much smaller than the real thing so the width of the front console, even the UFC is also smaller because of the um, the Cougar as well. So everything is much smaller. So the width of the console is smaller than the actual. So DTM. So DTM, we just have this panel and the text. 135 length by 30 okay all these are estimations i don't even know the actual size then the box this is actually for the to simulate the push button so have this pad have another one at the side and um pocket this one pocket it down then have a small one with the text and stick on it okay stick on it here and then hot glue it at the side here this one you can cover it cover the back with a very thin um, piece of PLA rectangle or a board or piece of paper all right um, third is the MPD handles. You start off with this shape, two holes for the screws, then you fillet the inside, okay, by seven. Then you fillet the outer corners, two corners, again by seven. Um, Next, we have the breaker panels. It's like a C and another one, a reversed C. So you have this C shape. Then you draw the lines here. Okay, to help you place the text. I don't even know what is AFCS. DC 
So anyway, you place one above, one below, the line will cut through, all right? It will cut through here. So three, one, two, three, three sets. Then now the reversed C, which is much longer. And this time, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so the one in the middle will be on the line. Okay, so just place them, tag size about 4.2. Now, the last one is the air vent. So have a box thickness. Use the thickness icon. Then at the the side over here, okay, you have all this, and you pad. You will become like this. Then you want to do these vertical slots. Okay, go up. and repeat the caps on the other side and then you want to fillet the corners fillet the inside fillet the outside okay so this is a final product this actually doesn't move at all um it's fixed okay i didn't bother trying to engineer and make this movable it's just for sure so this is the finished part. As you can see here, I just put um, push buttons to simulate the breakers, not wired to anything. So this is a much longer reverse C, and then this is the C, and then this is the fixed vent, and optional is this thing here, the handle. I just stick it in there, and you can leave it there or glue it. You can... Um, at the back, try to make it rotate against something or just put it there. Anyway, this is whole thing is for sure. You will probably forget about it. All right, once it's up and running. And inside, you can place something to cover it. Okay, something thin. And then you have a big um, O panel here. All right, of this size, roughly. And then we are done with all this optional. Okay, you will make the whole front console look very complete. So we are completely done with the build and the next video I will explain how to set up Helios. Okay, your main monitor, this second monitor for all these um, instrument gauges and the MPDs. And another third um, screen monitor for the UFC. Okay, that will be interesting. See you next time.